How much do I need for a down payment? Well, we are talking about that today and we are starting right now. Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Ashley Journey and I'm a realtor and buyer specialist with Town in Charlottesville, Virginia. You can learn more about us by visiting our website at townseville.com. So you guys are here because you wanna know how much you need for a down payment. Well, there are a couple of different answers to this question, but the national average for down payment is 11%. That figure includes first time and repeat buyers. While the broad down payment average is 11%, first time home buyers usually only put down three to 5% on a home. That's because several first time home buyer programs don't require big down payments. For instance, the FHA loan requires 3.5% down. Some programs also allow down payment contributions from family members in the form of a gift. There are also programs that require even less of a down payment. VA loans and USDA loans can be made with zero down. However, these programs are more restrictive. VA loans are only available to former or current military service members, and USDA loans are only available to low to middle income buyers in USDA eligible rural areas. There are programs that require more of a down payment, such as conventional loans, which requires a 20% down payment. These types of loans are typically taken out by repeat buyers who could use equity from their existing home as a source of down payment funds. However, some new conventional loan programs are available with 3% down if the buyer carries private mortgage insurance or PMI. Okay, now I know I threw a lot of information at you, so if you have any questions, feel free to leave it in the comments below. There are a lot of different loan programs and I plan on making a video about those later and getting more into the specific details about each. So be sure to subscribe to my channel and turn on notifications by tapping the little bell so that you don't miss out on any of the future information that could be helpful to you. If you like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. Thank you so much for watching. See you next time.